YouTube. Your boy is back once again with another dating and relationships video. Okay, so the subject today is should you take back your ex-girlfriend? Now, if there's some guy out here watching this really heartbroken about his girlfriend leaving him, his opinion might be, yeah, hell yeah. Oh, oh, if she wants me back, I'll gladly take her back. On the other hand, you might have some red pill brothers or even some MGTOW guys saying, should you take your ex-girl back? Hell no. No way. But you know things are not as straightforward as that. And that's why these videos can't be one minute, two minute, three minutes long. Yeah? It's not just should you take your ex-girlfriend back. It's if you decide to take your ex-girlfriend back. Also, how do you take her back? So get comfortable. I'm going to give you the teaching. So, we're going to touch on the how in a bit. But should you take your ex-girlfriend back? Take her back if you want. But you need to consider these things first. First of all, you need to understand why she left you in the first place. So, maybe she told you when you lot broke up. So you already know. Sometimes girls might tell you the they might not tell you the real reason why they broke up with you but okay maybe she told you so you already know or maybe she hasn't told you but it's obvious why yeah it's obvious why but if you don't know why she broke up with you and she wants you back you need to know the reason first you need you need to know you can ask her directly you can ask her indirectly Whatever way you need to know why she left you. You can't be taking back your ex-girlfriend and you don't know why she left you. Yeah? But for most people, it's going to be pretty obvious. So that's that part. Now, you also need to know why she wants you back. So, whatever way you say it. Oh, so, okay, so you're interested in me now again, yeah? Like, whatever way, Yeah? I'm not going to prescribe the way to say it, but you need to find out. Not in no bitch way. You just need to know why she wants you back. Oh, so you want to work this thing out. And just leave it open for her to sit, you know, to tell you. Don't be rude. And now this is if you're considered taking her back. Don't be rude, but don't be overexcited. Yeah. We're going to touch on that in a bit. But just, you need to know the reason why she wants you back. So you need to know why she left you. And you need to know why she wants you back. Now, number three. So, some of you, your girlfriend might leave you. You might have been heartbroken. You, your heart might have been in a million pieces. Others, it might be, you know. Because it all depends on how much you was into the girl. Yeah. Right. Like how long you've been with her. And also maybe how long you split up. Because she might have broken you up with you yesterday and wants to take you back today. And you haven't even really felt that effect. Yeah. So. Right, gents. Yeah. Number three. You need to know. Listen, if you take her back, are you going to be able to handle that pain again? If if you handle, if you experience heartache in the first place, as I said, some guys it's not going to affect as much. Yeah? But if she left you and it affected you emotionally, ask yourself, because some men might as go as far as have some mental problems because their girlfriend left them. Yeah? It's a serious thing. And as I've said before, when breakups happen, normally it's the female doing the breaking up in a relationship. Yeah? 
So you need to know if she takes me back. Because if she could do it once, she could do it again. That's like <laughs> that's clear cut. If she if she can if she can leave you once, she can leave you again. So you need to know if she leaves me again, can I handle this? So yeah, you're gonna go into the relationship now knowing that it can happen again. Because you're not gonna be silly. You know she could if she does it once, she can do it again. But you need to know, can I handle this? Or how am I gonna handle this if it happens? Yeah. Be true to yourself. Yeah, you need to look out for your mental health. Respect your time. Yeah, it's not about, oh, my days. This amazing girl that gave me the chance of being with her, she left me. Oh, my God, she wants me back. I've got a second chance. You can't look at it like that. It's all about you. She wants me back. Look at how she made you feel when she left you. Look at how she made you feel. Yeah? Are you going to take her back? Yeah, if she leaves you again, are you going to be able to handle it? Is it going to be worth it? Right, so, the, so these things you need to consider. So, I'm not going to say never take your ex-girlfriend back. No. That wouldn't be right. Because not all, this, not all situations are the same. You could have been with her for two months, two years, two decades. It's all different. You could have been really into her. Yeah? Right? You could have been slipping a bit and, you know, you chose you chose to be in a relationship with a girl that you generally consider a five out of ten, but you dropped your standards. Hey, you know what? I shouldn't have even been in a relationship with her in the first place. Let me improve myself. Let me get a better girl. Do you understand? Right? So, you, you, you've considered it now. Yeah? It's okay. You've considered it. Yeah? You, you're going to take your ex-girlfriend back. It's just, it's just not... You, it can't just be, okay, I'm taking her back. That's it. How do you take her back? Right. First of all, yeah? When you take your ex-girlfriend back... It can't be the same at the beginning. She's going to have to earn you back. Even if this was this nine and a half out of ten girl that you loved so much. Yeah, you need, listen, you need, she needs to go through hoops of fire. Maybe not hoops of fire, but it needs to be a process. It needs to be a process. You can't just be going to each other's house like you did before, lying on the couch, eating popcorn like it was all rosy. Because if she can leave you, right? If she can leave you and get you back. If she can leave you and get you back. Hold on a second, let me sort out the light. Right. If she can leave you Excuse that If she can leave you And Take you back that easily get, What makes you think She ain't just gonna Dump you Try to get back if you Dump you try, Because I know I know I know a couple of couples That have Broken up and got back together Many times in short periods of time And normally it's the girl doing the breaking up So that means the guy Is allowing the woman to just break up and come You know what I'm saying Sometimes it's even a license for her to go and See Tyrone It's a license for her to go and See Shaquan It's a license for her to go and See Leroy Yeah Like it's a serious thing. She breaks up with you and you consider taking her back, right? Listen, she needs to earn her place back. You need to make it tough for her, yeah? Because you need to be you need to be worth fighting for. And, yeah, some of you guys, you might have just split up with your girl. You might be scared and think, oh, I don't want to make it tough for her. I'm happy to take her back. Because, because she might, she might think, 
you know what? He's he's playing tough to get. Forget this guy. You guys, you guys might be afraid of that, and I'm not. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not here to lie to you. That might happen, but at least you know it wasn't worth taking her back. If she wants you back, but she's not willing to, you know, make an effort to get you back. Yeah. Then you shouldn't be taking her back. Do you understand? Right? So it's not like, oh, let me come round your house and stay and, and, and stay a couple of nights, Friday and Saturday night. Yeah? No. Or oh, right, let's go out for drinks. No. We'll, we'll go out for a coffee in the afternoon. Meet me here. No, not meet at your house, meet me here. Yeah? And you're not seeing her every other day. Yeah, I'll meet you here for a coffee. Okay. Like, then she's, she's going to ask you, oh, when can I see you again? Oh, maybe next week or the week after. You, you know, give her a day. Or let her know you'll get back to her. Make her, make her wait a couple of days and say, oh, yeah. Or or maybe even wait three days. Maybe she might hit you up again in, in, in between that. Yeah? Let her try to get you back. If you want to take her back, yeah? Not saying to do no acting thing like tell her no, no, and hope she begs. No, if you want her back, yeah? Okay, cool. Get back with her. But let it be a process. Don't make it easy. Don't invite her around and she can stay the weekend. No, we'll meet outside somewhere. Yeah? Right? And when you decide, okay, she can come to back to your house, right? When you decide she can come back to your house, she's got to give you... And then and listen to me. She's got to give you the type of sex that she knows you like. She's got to impress you all over again. Yeah? It has to be a process. It has to be a process. Yeah? She needs to earn you back. It needs to be like, oh, I don't want to leave this guy again. And also, gents, if you've been watching my videos, you need to know, you, you should already know that if your girlfriend has left you, you're moving on and you're improving yourself. So if you have been watching my videos and you have, you know, your girlfriend has left you and she is trying to come back, you should be in a better place than when you was when she left you so you know it depends what your your main things in life are you know you might be hitting the gym your body might be better you might have increased your earnings yeah you might have a plan you might have you might have goals in life you know you, you might be in a direction in your life where you where you wasn't before yeah you, you understand what i'm saying so and you need to focus on yourself. Obviously, if you're in a relationship, yeah, you need to give time to the relationship. But you are number one. And she needs to feel that. You don't say it to her. You don't say, oh, I'll take you back, but I'm going to focus on me more. For no, 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 no. Actions speak louder than words. You don't need to say none of that. You don't need to say, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm focusing. It, it, she, but she needs to feel it. And she needs to earn back your time. In relationships, yeah, for women, time is a very important thing. Some men can have a girl and, like, see them twice a week for about an hour and a half and just do bare sexual activities. And if he knows the girl's committed to that, he's cool. Women want your time. So if she wants, so if she wants you back, she wants your time. She needs to earn your time. Yeah? The time you spend with her needs to be gradual. Yeah? And us men, we are sexual creatures more than females. So every time you see her, so apart from the little coffee shop bit that I said at the start, when she's earning back your time, when you're at home, yeah, like, it's not about let's go Tesco shopping together. No. She needs to be giving you back massages, giving you the kind of sex you want, making you chicken wings, blood, or whatever you like. Do you, do you get that? Let her earn you back. Yeah? And if she don't want to do that, then cool. Because if 
she wants an easy ride if she wants an easy ride that means it's not worth taking her back yeah S like sex keeping girls in the rotation just seeing girls cool yeah you might deal with women that have a bit of you know want certain things it like because dating is is a game in it so you know women like you you want sex from a woman uh, um and they want time and attention or whatever from you yeah some women want money some women want lots of dates meals whatever and, and, and you know it's a game it's is what she can get out of you what you can get out of her but for a relationship ah you can't you can't be a forget that's not serious doesn't matter if the body's 10 out of 10 and she's really, really pretty. No. This is your life, your time, your mental health. So let's sum this up, right? Let's sum this up. Should you take back your ex-girlfriend? It's up to you. You need to know why um, she left you. You need to know why she's taking you back and you need to know if you can handle it, yeah? And then how you take her back, you make her work for it. Yeah? You make her work for it. Yeah? Okay? So, and one more thing. So, if you take back your ex-girlfriend, like, if you're going to take her back, you need to know. Throughout the relationship, you need to keep in the back of your mind that this girl, this girl could leave me at any time. And if you see them signs coming back, how she started to get when she's about to like for example if the sex started slowing down she started seeming more unhappy yeah if you see those signs come back yeah you can try and tackle it and and and, and try to think how can i fix this or you could just say you know what i can see this girl is not feeling me anymore no you leave her trust me you'll feel better if you leave her rather than she leaves you even if she's that 10 out of 10 because more of the heartbreak is the fact that a lot of the heartbreak is the fact that you lost, like she left you, like plain and simple, like no beating around the bush. Like, yeah, if you leave her because you see the signs of her being unhappy, yeah, you might feel a little way, yeah, but it's it's not gonna be as harsh as her actually leaving you, her being in the driver's seat to say, yes, this is over, yeah? So, so if, you, if you're gonna take back your girl, you need to ask, you need to be ready. Am I, am I, am i okay with keeping in the back of my mind that this girl could leave me at any time i'm okay with having the rest of my relationship like this yeah if it comes to a point where you guys are talking about kids or she's hinting about marriage you're gonna have to keep that in the back of your mind she was able to leave me once she could do it again anyone could do that anyway but do you understand if she's left you once already you need to more have that in the back of your mind yeah now if you lot get really old together and you're both in wheelchairs or you're both in a walking stick or whatever, then you don't, <laughs> obviously you don't need to keep that in the back of my mind. She can still leave you, like, but I'm saying, obviously if you're both old and gray, then yeah, you, you don't have to keep that in the back of your mind so much, right? But if you, like, take back your ex-girlfriend if you want, but you need to know the reasons that she left you and that she's taking you back and if it's not reasons that's gonna you know match your you know the way you can live a healthy healthy life health when i'm talking about health i'm talking about mental health and a relationship that you know the woman respects your time and your goals yeah a woman that wants to be on you with your mission like on your mission with you or the direction you're going in life not you're in a relationship with her so you drop everything and you know you're just there on the couch every night eating ice cream and popcorn watching films until a couple of months or a couple of years go by and she thinks this guy ain't ish and she starts looking at tyrone do you get that anyway right comment below yeah let me know if you agree with what I'm saying because I like to get a conversation with you guys. I like to hear you guys' opinion, yeah? And if you like the video, hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And if you like the content, this is what you do. You hit the notification bell. That way YouTube will let you know when I upload another dating and relationships video.